gang. Why aren't you in class yet? Lose. What do you mean? Classes are still like in 10 minutes. Edda, you liar. How dare you wake me up from my Azura dream and make me rush to school, huh? Anyways, you guys want to help me with this red string? Red string? Yeah! So long story short, I woke up with this red string tied to my pinky and I thought it was a prank from Edda, so I asked her if she did this, but she was playing around acting like she couldn't see it and I was, and then Edda did this and that, lose. Lose, slow down for a sec, eep! Of course we'll help you with the red string, but first, where is the red string? You too? Pfft. Come on, Willow, stop playing around. You and I both know that you can clearly see the red string on my hand, right? I don't think so. I don't see any string anywhere. Maybe you're just seeing thing? Did Etta give you some apple blood? Why don't we go to the healer's office so that you can rest? Maybe you're just tired. Guys, I'm serious. I don't know why you guys can't see the red string, but there really is a red string on my hand. Maybe someone just put a spell on you just to mess with you. Maybe. But I'll find out who's behind this no matter what, so I'm gonna continue following the string. Uh, well, that was something. Should we be concerned? I'm not sure. A part of me is sure that she's gonna be fine, but then again, she is loose, so who knows what crazy stuff and ideas she has in her head right now. Is that a yes? Probably. Come on, String! You gotta end at some point! How long can you be? I swear, if you don't end right now, I'll shave you into someone's... Hmm? Oh, the String really ended. But I honestly did not expect this. Mm. Hey, Amity, what you listening to, huh? Why don't you take the other bud and find out? And maybe stop being so oblivious. Oh my gosh, really? Hmm. This is a nice friend activity. Huh? Oh. You're so stupid. Huh? Wait! Amity! Oh my god! Why did I do that? Oh my... Oh my god! Amity! Hmm? Amity? I'm sorry, I... I wasn't thinking. I didn't... It's okay, Amity. Please just look at me. Here. Hmm? Hmm? Hmm. I like you too. Luz? Luz? King? Edda? Hmm. Anyone? Huh? A key? Hmm. Huh? So this is the human world? Just a quick in and out. Find, lose, then go. Huh? This place is huge. I'll never be able to find her. This was such a stupid idea. I wonder. Eep! Oh god, what is that? Amity? What are you doing here? You left, Luz. You didn't tell anyone. Luz? We can't be here when my mom comes back. Hmm. We should be good now. Luz? Hmm. Luz, why did you leave? You didn't even say goodbye. Does Edda even know you're gone? Edda's gone, Amity. And it's all my fault. Hmm. You can't be serious, right? You don't even know what happened. You're right. But I know you, Luz. You're kind. You always try to do good. I pushed you away for so long, but you still came back. Luz, I... We need you to come back. At least until we figure this out. Okay. Luz, we can fix this together. Ah, who would like to be the victim today? No volunteers? 
How about you, Miss Blight? Please come to the front and demonstrate how to concentrate your magic. Concentrating magic is vital for casting many spells. The trick is to relax and slow your heart to where you can focus on getting a steady flow of magic. Miss Blight here is top of the class and I have faith that she will set a good example for all of you. Splendid! As you can see, she has a tight hold on her power and has compacted it into a ball of energy. The amount of magic you will steadily be able to hold will increase over time. Hmm. Uh, uh, Miss Blight, please concentrate. What has it gotten into you? It's okay, Amity. Everyone has a little stage fright. Luz, how are you this oblivious? Study time. Mm. Ugh, we've been doing this for hours. How do you do this every day? This is torture. Mm. It's been 20 minutes. Uh, mm. <sighs> well, I guess a short break won't hurt. Really? Planned the study time because she knew this would happen. <laughs> mm. 